Hey you guys and welcome back to Island where uh, we are going to do some hunting today. I crafted a bow. I went around grabbed some feathers and other materials to make arrows. It, I'm going to go forth and get some uh, food for us in the long term. I feel like that's going to be a good kind of initial thing to do. It's not like we're growing any crops yet. Shoot, I still don't even know what I'm doing in this game. And um, yeah, so we have 50 arrows. Hopefully... It's uh, an easy time hunting, and uh, I saw plenty of boar around on the island already. So we're just going to go off here, and hopefully with some uh, leather, we might be able to make ourselves some proper clothes, shoes, and things. So we're not running around in our underwear anymore. So let's head up here and see what all we can find. Uh, let's go into first person view. All right. Not much around from what I can see. We can't really climb the mountainside because that is a little too high up and a little cold. We don't have the clothing kind of required for that. So we'll go around. <gasps> Look, there's a goat out on the beach. So I'm going to shoot uh, probably in first person. I'm assuming it's going to be easier with the aiming reticule there. And, uh, okay, well, we hit it. It's, uh... Come on. Okay, three arrows for the goat there, and uh, it's, it's limping. It's limping. It's limping. Nope, we missed. And there it goes. Okay. So let's see. Do we get any of our arrows back? It does not look like it. Let's uh, drop some stuff. It seems like we are basically out of inventory space. Uh, let's equip some carrots, and I guess we'll just eat these real quick. There we go. I mean, we could turn them into seeds, and that would be a good use of our time, but let's just uh, keep hunting here. Pretty cool to do a bow kind of so early on. I think it'll be useful for us. And uh, stone arrows. Now, I would make a crossbow, but me, myself, I'm a little bit more partial for a longbow or recurve bow like this one here. And um, let's see if there's anything else we can kill and then probably head back, uh, make this all uh, crafted into leather. Maybe some shrubs around that we could possibly use. We're on the uh, back side of the island now, pretty much where we spawned. Oh, another goat. Uh, okay, so I hold right click and uh, I can go into aiming mode here. Bop. Right in the right in the kisser. Come here, you. Where are you going? Wow, I'm pretty quick. Okay. Don't know. Oh, oh. It really shouldn't take this many arrows, in my opinion, but that's fine. Some more raw meat for us, and some more goat hide. Now I don't know what the respawn rates are on these things. There's a little bit of a campfire area not too worried in fact we haven't i wonder can, can i shoot the bird down all right well that's a little low uh, look closer come on i want to shoot the bird down you know what let's let's shoot the bird we're gonna get a little closer to the bird here and we're gonna try for maybe this one Come on. Don't know how close I am really to it. Looks like I'm slightly below it. Ugh, man, it's, it's hard to tell when they're that far away and I can't get any more up the mountainside or else that's just simply uh, too cold. Oh, there's a boar over here that I just saw. There he is. There he is. Come here, guy. Nope. No, he's juking me. All right, we got him. There we go. So we get some more raw meat. We'll drop. Uh, we'll drop this flax for now and pick up this hide. Okay. So more leather found for our uh, tanning rack. This is uh, something. What is this? Looks like this is an iron ore. Alright, so we're starting to learn. We're, we're learning what materials are. And um, 
Depends on the looks. There's a bear. Probably don't want to mess with the bear. Uh, I'm, I may have 26 arrows, but uh, let me tell you, if, if I can't even kill a goat in 6 arrows, I doubt I'll be able to kill a bear in 20. So we'll just go along the shore, you know, besides this beautiful water as the sun sets. And um, see if there's anything else. Oh, there's a boar off in the distance there, so we will come over to it. I want to leave that boar alone. That one looks a little bit less friendly. Oh, okay, just making sure he's not charging us there. There we go. Some plenty of meat here. Looks like we're getting about 2x meat every time we kill one of these. So we'll head around. Hunter Uthris on the scene. So we should be coming up back around. I don't know how big this island is, to be honest. There's another bear. We'll uh, head down this way. But we should be coming around soon, I think, if my sense of direction is uh, at least somewhat decent, soon to our little log cabin framework. And we'll uh, probably finish building that this episode, so we at least can have a place called home. And uh, from that point on, uh, we'll, we'll come up with the community suggestions on what we want to work towards next. I have no clue. Um, really the progression of things in this game. I haven't really watched many other people play it. Um, I know other people are playing it, but uh, from, for now, I, I like to kind of discover things on my own. There's a bird over here. I don't want to try and shoot the birds down. Oh, come on. Oh, you jerk. Don't, don't, hey. Hey, don't you. Oh, I hit him. Or I'm hitting the ground, I can't tell. Is there no way to shoot down a bird? Uh, okay. Sh 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 oh, bastard. Started flying again. Come back here. Bastard. I don't think I can shoot these guys. Or maybe I'm just that bad of a shot. I'm probably that bad of a shot. We're, we'll, you know, maybe when I get a, uh, a good, accurate sniper rifle or something, I'll go for that. Oh my god, bear. Bear, run away, run away, run away. A lot of bears. A lot of bears on this side of the island. Maybe we should call this place Bear Island. And, uh, where the heck is my home? It should, it should be like right here. Is it really that far? Hold on, let's just skip. Let's just skip our way, our way home. Okay, this island is a lot bigger than I thought it was. Based on like the slight curve, uh, that we could kind of see around. I figured it would be a lot smaller, but this is taking a lot longer than I expected. Already, already a third of the way into this episode, and it's becoming dark. And there is... What is this? Well, there's a lantern. So, uh... You know, don't, don't mind if I uh, do here. Let's just uh, pick that up. Meat slice. There's a stone knife. <gasps> a bandit hat! pull a wooden chest. It's locked. I have no clue how to break into it. I want that hat, though. So, uh, let's equip this and eat it. Bennett hat is had, and there we go. Top hat acquired. Okay. So, we're looking dapper. Rather dapper. So, there's a lot of little secrets on the island. Like, a lot of little pre-built things, maybe for people to find and explore. I like that. Um, with this game. It's it's heavily exploration based and uh, It's always good for these crafting survival games. Come here. Come here uh, Horse you're wild. I can't tame you yet. I would like to tame a horse eventually and Maybe build a stable for him Something is growling at me. Oh, it's you You know what? I don't like you Take that wolf Wolf meat and more raw meat. Okay, so there is plenty of hides, and it's basically nighttime, so I just want to go straight home at this point, which I, currently I have no clue where that might be. Um, I'm thinking we're up on that ridge, though I don't see our wood structure. It might just be a little out of the load. There it is, it popped in. So, yes, we have made it all the way around the island. We have gone hunting a little bit, 
And I think at this point, we just need to finish up the structure. Now, I was trying to go through a little bit off camera and figure out um, a possible wall piece that we could use. And currently, it kind of looks like we're stuck using um, just like a log cabin. Uh, unlike the bamboo, it doesn't look like there's any good wall tiles to use, like thin wooden planks, or maybe I just don't have access to them. So let's go ahead and interact with this. We'll uh, craft those, this, and that up. And then we will lie on this little makeshift bed and sleep as we watch the moon come across the sky. And then now we are in morning. Okay, maybe we didn't sleep enough. Now we are in morning. Look at that sunrise. Did my game just crash? My game just crashed. Oh no. All right, so we are back um, after that crash. Crash, and it seems like on the way there, I kind of, I kind of died. So uh, we lost our hat, but I was able to uh, make it back and uh, make some of this leather. Um, so we're gonna, I guess, make some string and see if string plus leather equals clothes. I have no idea. Um, uh, other than that, we are a little bit hungry. So let's see, what can I do for food? Let's hop in here and quickly make a fire pit I think because we should still have uh, a lot of our items here so let's go ahead and light this up just ignore the fact that we're standing completely within a wooden structure so we'll craft uh, six of those four of these and we should be good to go in terms of food Let's go back over here, take a look at this. It looks like our yarn is almost fully processed. I'm happy that uh, even though each piece of yarn takes a minute or so to craft, you can craft up to nine at a time, which I think is a good way to do it. So there we go. We have our yarn and we have our leather on hand. So let's scroll through and see what it is we can make here with that. We need a sewing kit, which I have no clue what that takes to make so let's go up and see if there is up oh, here it is sewing kit it takes one yard and any needle we had a wooden needle there so we'll craft that and now we can craft oh, a pirate captain's hat oh my i got it i gotta make that there we go we have a pirate captain's hat who needs the bandit hat when you can look like this uh perfect okay so Maybe we can make a boat eventually and leave this pesky island. So there's some other hats you can make. I'm not really worried about that. There is uh, some bellows, a bicorn hat, a cowboy hat if you want to ride around on a horse. But let me tell you, this pirate hat is just too much. So fur boots and things, kind of interesting. Rabbit hides, wolf hide, a leopard hide. We might need hide in sewing kits to actually make some proper clothes or bag. Well, you know what? Maybe we can make some cloth. We have some yarn. We just need to get back in a, uh, well, that's a spinning wheel. What's a, what's a loom? So let's see. So weaving loom. So we need pole and any rope. So let's go ahead and do that. So pole, one, two. Okay, we're out of knives. That's fine, you know, we can. Craft another one there. And uh, three, four, five, six or so. Uh, loom. All right, any rope. So let's go back to crafting here. And uh, one, two, there we go. We're, we're just trying to expand our crafting capabilities at this point. As much as I want to finish our hut right now, I have a feeling that uh, the hut, at least the walls of it, are going to come a little bit later. So we have enough to craft a piece of cloth. And hopefully with that cloth in our inventory, we might be able to craft something a little bit more great. Some some more grand things. This herb bag sounds cool. I wonder if there's a different type of bag for many things. So herb bag. So let's go ahead and craft uh, one of these. There we go. Let's see what that does. There we go. That uh, in our inventory. Now if I place that, I can open it. Right, okay. 
And we can put our herbs in here, I suppose. And then if I pick it up, I guess we can just have it in our inventory. It's not gonna reflect anything in there. Ah, so you let's simply left click on it and it opens it up. That's interesting. Now, can we drag and drop? Oh, it looks like we can. So we can put all of our grasses and things into this, I think. Yes, so it remains in there. Okay, so let's put some hay in it. Maybe uh, some grains. Nope, can't put grains. That's, I guess that doesn't really count as an herb. Spinach? Nope, That's. I guess that's a food. There's some rags. I think that's our broken hat from earlier. All right, let's go in here and get our cloth. Go into crafting and see. Oh, look, we can make we can make some shirts and things and some socks and uh, some hats and some shoes. So we're progressing. Northern uniform. Okay. Some flags, some ship flags. Oh my goodness, all the flags. Okay, that's too many flags. A lot of options there. Tattered ship flag. Holy cow. That is cool. Woodsman's hat. Uh, I can make a lantern. I already have one. Some crowns. Oh, I was hoping for some more clothing options so we could breathe kind of some, some more Egyptian canvas. I don't know what canvas is for. Is that a cloth kind of wall? Boy, the, the crafting is, is n okay, shirts. Here we go. A witch hat, wizard hat, sombrero, uh, Egyptian tunic. That might be a good shirt option. So let's craft that. There we go. So this can be our shirt. You know, not much different. It's still white, but we have some wooden trim there. And uh, I guess we can get some more flax around. Yeah, there, there's plenty of flax, so let's just gather this up here. Now I guess I could be planting this, and that's something I probably wanna do for our cloth. Doesn't look like we have cotton here on this island. So maybe let's plant uh, some flax. So this, this is definitely a hunting gathering episode, it seems. A lot of running around. Okay, so flax there. Flax is uh, luckily pretty easy to spot. It's just this nice uh, green stem with white flowers. All right, and if I select the flax, where is it? Where'd it go? Is it in my bag? It's in my bag, there we go. So we can break it into flax seeds. There we go. And go over in here. And we should have a bunch of flax seeds now, yes. All right, that's good. So we'll just plant flax pretty much all, all through here. Okay, this is gonna take a little bit, it seems. Uh, it's not quite an instant thing. I'm kind of glad though, you know, kind of make your work for it and just walk in a straight line, plant uh, flax pretty much every step. Do the same over here. Hello, boar. I thought you were uh, something here to kill me. I was actually somewhat afraid for a half second or so. So we'll just plant all this stuff down just so we have it for later. Always good to have a little bit of a renewable resource, especially for something that it seems like we need a lot of. Uh, flax uh, takes a couple flax to make uh, one cloth, and each cloth is going to uh, make one item of clothing, maybe some canvas for a ship or so, so we can maybe leave and explore the island, and maybe with a canvas we can make a map. And with a map, we'll uh, be in a good position to find home when we leave. Plenty, plenty of stuff here. Now, I wonder how closely you can plant this together. Right now we have a good spacing, at least somewhat of a good spacing. I will say as a person who builds and enjoys the um, the OCD of Planet Coaster, that is the ugliest farm I have ever planted. All right, let's just gather up normal flax. Uh, I think 40 or so flax plants uh, to be replanted is plenty. And if we can harvest half of it, 
and uh, replant half of it. That's a, that'll be a good ratio. Technically, we'd only have to replant a third because each each uh, flax plant grants three seeds. But um, I would I like to expand our our farm there or lack thereof per se. Okay. I think it's a good thing that we kind of decided to replant because flax, you know, me running around spamming right click has kind of, I think we picked up and used a lot of flax at this point. All right, there we go. I think that'll be plenty for now. We got some trees regrowing from replanting those from a long time ago. So spinning wheel. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Now, if we go to our little herb bag, yeah, you can see flax is in there. So we just had to wait a minute or so, and it looks like we'll have enough to uh, create two new pieces of cloth, and uh, then we'll have some pants. So we could get some leather. Let's um. Let's see. Where is my bow? Here it is. We have our bow. It doesn't have many arrows left, but we can craft a few more. And I wouldn't mind some leather. Just some raw leather. It's getting windy. Boy, is it windy. If we had a, a sailing ship, that would be nice with this wind here. Also, I think I think we should have cooked a bunch of meat on that fire. So let's, let's go check that out. The fire is probably out. Skip, 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 skip. Good. Look at that. Plenty of food to last us. So we'll eat this. Go. Okay, how's our inventory? Pretty full. Drop these rags, we don't really need those. Grasses can go in our herb bag. That's fine. Uh, bark, do I really need bark? Probably not. All right. And if I come over here, I think we can open this up, get our yarn, throw this into the loom. So we'll get two pieces of cloth from that. And let's see about getting some leather too over here. Ah, there's a boar. Now, I wouldn't mind some better leather, like wolf and things. Those look like the proper uh, items to use for for some clothing. Up. Oh, there's a cat. Nope. Take that. Take that. Come back here, you dang cat. Quit your running. There we go. All right, anything else around? There's a rabbit. I know rabbit was uh, on the list of fur boots or something. Oh, oh hello. <laughs> You thought you could stay hidden, just uh, blending in with the ground there, but you thought wrong, little rabbit. I have no clue what to drop. Uh, let's just drop some, some dirt. Who needs dirt, really? There we go. So, pick up this rabbit hide. And where'd that other rabbit go? I don't see it. Looking for that movement. Granted, the other one that we just killed is standing completely still. I don't see it. That rabbit was pretty quick, too. Probably wouldn't be able to hit it. My skills are rather poor, it seems, with this game. All right, let's, let's go back up. Let's see if we can make anything already. I mean, fur boots. Bunch of fur boots, but I don't think anything that we can really do yet. All right, let's go to the loom. Not enough inventory space. Inventory space is becoming a bit of an issue. 
Let's just drop that egg. Take some cloth. Crafting. So that's Egyptian tunic. Let's go to the clothing section. So we can make leather shoes. You know, that'd be fine. But we're, we're already basically wearing leather shoes. And you get some pants. All right, well, a pharaoh's skirt is gonna be uh, what we got, it seems. There we go. Uh, weird looking pirate we are, but we have food. We have some crafting stations, so that's good. And uh, we have still no home. Wow, we are poor. But tell you what, I think this is where we're gonna leave it off on this episode. You tell me in the comments down below what you wanna do. We can finish the house, we can continue working on crafting and progression that way. Um, and, and give me tips and advice down below. If you like the stuff, feel free to subscribe for more creative goodness such as this. Go ahead and hit that like button and I will see you guys in the next episode.